front of the net. No score, first period, 15, 25 to go. Johnson alone in front on a feed from Will Smith. Couldn't make the conversion. It was Belanger getting a piece of it. Malatest at the point, fires one in traffic. Kept in. Smith along the blue line, back to Klebanski. There's a wrist shot. Tipped in front, they score! They score. Kevin Klima nice. on a loose puck in front of the net. And the Wildcats take the lead. That goal coming at 4.40. Klebanski threw one to the net. Kevin Klima, number 34 with the rebound. And it's the check, but uh, the puck had already left the two players. And uh, it doesn't take long for the referees to call that. The referees tonight, Morris LeBlanc and Mario Maillet. Here's the announcement on the penalty. Gabe Britton on the power play. Livier from the point. Along the cray, there's a shot wide. That'll be a boarding call on Corby. There's in front. What a save by Forte in front. The rebound loose. He get over to the side to make the save. Livy in the point. Cape Britton on the power play. Moncton down the ice. Seconds left in the penalty, and then uh, he's going to come out of the box. Full tilt, I'm sure. Behind the net, Olivier Leblanc, number three. Fine skater, drops it back. The big winger, Dubois, nice move there on Weeder. Cuts over the Moncton line, puts on the brakes. Back to the point to Martineau. He'll throw it across on the wing. It's chipped out the wing, and Weeder breaks away. He's all by himself down the off wing. Cuts across the middle. Weeder moving in a shot. Right on. Just saved there by the goaltender, Belanger. Comes out to center ice and rifled right back in by Matt Klebanski. 10.45 to go. Physical tempo starting to pick up out there, Sarah, between both teams. Yeah, it's uh, getting really aggressive, so uh, hopefully they keep themselves on a leash a little bit, though. There's a hit there from Malatesta following up on his check. Just took the Cape Britain player right off the puck. It's starting to get physical again. Puck is chipped out to center ice, taken over by the Cats. There's a lead pass there and a beauty. defenseman, Matt Klebensky. A long pass on the wing for Will Bauer. Off a skate, it's rolling to the goaltender, and he had to clear it. Belanger off to the wing. Steven Johnson kept it in. Bel Johnson behind the net to Will Smith. Will Smith centering it. Bauer trying to convert it. A pile up down in front of the net. It scoots back to the point. Malatesta with a drive. Where is it? Under the goalie. He looked back. Cape Breton getting a penalty. Gosselin taking a shot at Steven Johnson after the whistle. Fans like that. I think number 15 going to the box. The year from the Moncton native coming at 1901. Cats leading it 2 0. First period action here at the Coliseum. Late first period. Moncton playing the body at every opportunity, really playing a strong, strong period against these aggressive Cape Breton Eagles. Here's the announcement on the goal. Score by number 12, Le Deuxième Bidé Wildcats, scored by the middle duels, Steven Johnson. Assisted by number 26, and it leads you to the middle, that's his William Bauer. And leading it 2 0, goals by Kevin Klima and Steve Johnson. Yeah, they're, and they're coming up full tilt like I expected them to right off the first period. Very aggressive. Same in the second, so let's keep this up. Zach Fortin, goal for the Wildcats. Alexandre Belanger for the Cape Breton Eagles. Third place in the Maritime Division. The Cats 7-4-1, and one, still on top by a couple of points over Charlottetown. Sveshnikov cuts to the middle, a shot. Nice pad save by Fortin, sliding across. 37 Sveshnikov, hawked by the Eagles. Cape Breton has the puck at their own blue line. Long pass there by three Cape Breton players, but no icing. Jacob Sweeney. Hit by Martineau in the corner. Reversed it though to Holwell. Holwell trying to bring it out, but it was blocked by the Eagles. Puck is just outside the blue line. Still inside the line. Cape Breton doing a nice job there. Lazarev walks in with a shot. Big save by Fortan. Two saves. Rebound to the side. And a whistle goes. So Cape Breton's coach must have told the... the Behind their own net. Colby Tower of four checking hard. Zach McEwen. Knocked off the puck. There's a lead pass. Ethan Crosman. Crosman steams down the right side. Great skater. Ethan Crosman cutting in. And he tried the backhand deke and it just slid off his stick. There's McEwen in front. A backhand shot. They score. Zach McEwen. After Ethan Crosman missed on a partial breakaway. The big scratch for PEI native puts it in on a backhand shot. And the Cats lead 3-0. That goal at 3.24. And waiting for some help. And set up his teammate there from the shot from the right. Lazarev. Cam Askew will rifle it around the boards. Back to the point kept in by Jacob Sweeney. Sweeney to Connor Garland. Garland kept it in. Nice play there to Askew in the corner. Askew throws it back up on the wall. It comes loose. And Cape Breton breaks down the wing. It's Maxim Lazarev. 
Drops it back to Clark Bishop. Bishop will not shoot. There it is. Big pad saved by Forte on Clark Bishop, who cut to his right. Zach Forte. Over, though. Connor Garland in the corner. Garland tried to center it. It's loose to the side. The Eagles with the puck inside their own zone. Moncton's up 3-0 with 13.40 remaining in the second period. Zach McEwen scoring earlier from Ethan Crosman. Forte has made some big saves for Moncton. Max Glassell behind the net. Lost it. There's a shot. Just wide. Zach Forte, huge save on that original shot. And the rebound went wide. Max Glassell totally collapsed behind the net as the puck went loose. Xavier Leblanc with the puck. Four checks it off his stick. Duncan McIntyre up to the wing through center. Inside the Moncton zone. Glassell takes over. Glassell throws it up the wall. Picked off there by number 22, Fournier. They jam in along the boards in the corner. Moncton's up 3 0. A play from the middle, they score! What a backhander there by Fournier, number 16, number Sorrentino, pardon me. Cape Breton, the big number 16 coming out of the corner. The Coliseum. Goals by Klima, Kevin, Steve Johnson, Zach McEwen, and for the Cape Breton Club, Pierre Luc Dubois. Great individual effort coming out of the corner on a backhand beating Zach Fortin. Loose puck in front of the Cape Breton net, chip to the corner. Cats are on the power play with 50 seconds left. Along the boards in the Cape Breton zone, back to the point. It's thrown into the side. Kevin Klima in front for Liam Murphy. They score on a rebound. It looked like the goalie had it. Liam Murphy for the Wildcats on the power play. Around at the blue line, the Eagles throw it out to center ice. Clark Bishop taken off the puck by Matt Klebanski. It's back to Bishop. Bishop lost the puck and away go the Wildcats with a 4-1 lead. Three minutes to go. Weeder and back to Klebanski. Garland picks up the loose puck. The shot, they score! Rebound, Wiederer! Garland, let it go! And Wiederer with the open net. All he had to do was slide it to the open net. 5-1, Wildcats. Connor Garland with that beautiful shot from Blue the line. Drop pass to Liam Murphy. Murphy throws it in the corner. Back to the point to Wiederer. Wiederer throws it across to Malatesta. Malatesta slides it in the corner to Kevin Klima. He'll cut to the middle. Number 34, a shot a high riser over the net. Rebound to the side to Liam Murphy. Murphy off the puck. Sveshnikov, the Russian, lost it. There's a sweep shot in front. They score! Kelly Klima from Liam Murphy. Loose puck in front. Klima just swept it in the open side as the Cape Breton players were looking around for the puck. Yeah, and that's what they're focused too much on the puck rather than watching the players boxing it out. They're shorthanded, and uh, it's almost like... And towards the net, Murphy trying to deflect that off his chest. Had potential there for the tip. Declan Smith for Cape Breton throws it in the corner. Max Glassell throws it around the wall, back to the point. Lewick Livier for it in front, loose puck. And the Wildcats are jamming up the slot and clearing it out of the way. Boucher throws it in front. There's a drive. It's loose in front. Chipped away by the Wildcats, and Fortin has it. Puck fell in behind Fortin. Sasha Gay showed up when he cleared it to the corner. It never did quite make it to the corner. No, that puck was it was there, and then when uh, the player went in trying to block it, and then the goaltender just covered it up quick and uh, had an opportunity to get a little rough.